this is a very, very special place right now. In the future, all the breakthrough in robotics, disaster relief robotics and human robotics will be coming out from people in this spray room. So this team, Team Thor, is a union of UCLA and the University of Pennsylvania. UCLA work more on the mechanical side of things, the platform, the robot itself, and the brilliant UPenn students work on more on the software side. We're a big team, we're a big family, we're good friends. Uh, we just did our rehearsal. It did driving perfectly. It drove all the way through. Everybody it really, really were excited and enjoyed it. Next hack was to open the door. And we had some difficulties. The robot, I don't, we're still trying to figure out what went, went really wrong, but the robot actually fell. And when it fell, it broke its arm. Robots are meant to fall sometimes, so that's expected. What's what's important is how you react to the fall. Okay. okay. All right. So we'll fix the robot and get ready for tomorrow. All right. Let's go back to work. <laughs> Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the DARPA Robotics Challenge of 2015. Ladies and gentlemen, start your robots. Okay, I'm running IMU. Start the IMU. Okay, we're good. The three tasks that we scored on are the three tasks that we practiced overnight. Now we have the confidence that if we practice a couple more tasks tonight, make sure that the robot is okay, then we're confident that we can try to push the robot a little bit more tomorrow to maybe get five or more points. Day two, we're looking for four, we're looking for speed, and we're looking to get into that debris and play with it like new tomorrow. <laughs> okay, guys. So have fun out there. Let's not run over any barriers or anything before we're told, and uh, let's not fall down. Does that sound good? All right. One, two, three. Two, two, four. Four. There we go. All right, guys, let's do it. Okay, now you should turn to the right. Good. Now turn left. Okay, turn left straight.
Uh, yes, I'm disappointed, but you can't always win, but you can always learn. So from this, I know a lot of successful people on teams. The difference between them and the not so successful team are everybody makes mistakes, everybody fails, but for those who actually study and learn from their mistakes, they use it as a stepping stone to go to the next step. And that's what we're gonna do today. I cannot be more excited about robotics at UCLA right now.